It's not surprising that scammers find ways to get our personal information. Don't fall prey to them, Freedom Family. Before we get right to it, check out our previous episodes to know more about the previous news. And also guys, have you ever been scammed before? I have. Let me know down in the comment section below. Alright guys, you know the drill. Subscribe and gong that bell. Gong! Hey guys, my name is Nold and welcome to Freedom News. On today's news, we will be talking about an interview from one of the emerging stars on YouTube. Also, Philip DeFranco has debunked scammers pretending to be content creators. You better watch out! Following the list is KSI reaching another milestone. I wonder what milestone that is. Lastly, have you seen George's videos? If you haven't, that's okay. You should check it out right now. Alright guys, drop it! YouTuber Karina Garcia has been skyrocketing her success on YouTube by producing slime videos that her fans love so much. Forbes has graced us with an article that kind of like interviewed her in a way. Let's not make a whole video about this, but we will be sharing to you guys the things that you need to know about brand building and social media. Let's get right to it. So Forbes has asked her about her social media and how she gives back to the community. Karina answered, I try to engage with my fans daily by commenting back as much as I can, whether it's through YouTube or Instagram. I like to do fun posts asking them questions about their day, etc. to get them involved. Being able to talk to my followers daily is a great feeling. It feels as though I have such a big group of friends. They're the best. Have you been doing this Freedom Family? I'm kind of guilty about this but I'm trying my best to do it. Moving on another question that may benefit you guys in the future is about brand building. Forbes has asked her for some tips on how to build a brand and this is what Karina answered. Building a brand takes a lot of work and you have to be patient because the chances of everything running smoothly 24-7 is not likely. You're going to have rough times and need to accept the failures may be ahead. You have to focus on your overall vision no matter what. Having a team surrounding you who understands your brand 100% is also key. You also need to be very involved and stay motivated because it will be a huge part of your life. Lastly guys, here's a little advice from Karina. Best piece of advice I've received for anyone wanting to start their own YouTube is to just do it and have fun. It sounds cliche, but really that is what holds people back, me included. I wanted to do it for years and I never knew if I was really ready. I learned there really isn't a right time. Just sit down and film and be yourself. At the end of the day, you're making these videos because you like the content you're putting out there. And that's what matters. So basically guys, just do it. I should listen to her because I haven't made my own channel yet. Yikes. Moving along the news, KSI, one of the pioneers of the video sharing age has reached 20 million subscribers. The and that's 20 million and one. KSI has been very pleased with this achievement. His high profile views from other content creators like Kudeka, Joe Weller, and Logan Paul has been very sensational and has garnered him views and subscribers. Dexterto has reported that KSI may have a rematch with Logan Paul as their boxing match from August of last year has been a draw. Hopefully someone KOs someone this time. Following the list is our own very Papa George who has released his 18th episode of KYC. If you haven't watched that video, don't worry, check it out later after this video. Papa George discusses a few guidelines why the channels featured on his videos are YPP suspended. We do not want you to be suspended guys so catch up on that episode to see if your channel is safe. Lastly guys, Philip DeFranco has released a video stating that scammers have a new way of fishing out for your personal information. Don't give them a chance to get your personal information guys. Business Insider quotes Philip DeFranco saying, If you have gotten a message from me or any other creator on YouTube that looks something like this, that is very likely someone trying to scam you. You might be wondering what YouTube has been doing to counteract the scam routine and they have graciously answered Business Insider with, we're aware and in the process of implementing additional measures to fight impersonation. In the meantime, we've removed accounts identified as spam. One way for you guys to be protected and also to stop the scam routine is by blocking them and reporting them to YouTube. Additional information states that 188 YouTubers have fallen prey to this kind of scam routine. And popular stars like James Charles, Jeffree Star, and Bad Baby has also reported this scam. Hey guys, are you looking for free graphics? Are you interested to have an amazing subscribe print? A Pikachu like button? A gamer graphic saying leave a comment? Or better yet, an amazing end card graphic? Well, we have that all for you. Check out our video factory and download them for your consumption. Rock out on your videos with our assets and start grabbing your audience's attention. That's the news guys, I hope you enjoyed it. What was the most relevant news to you? Have you ever fallen to this kind of scam? And if you were magically given 20 million subscribers on your YouTube account, 
what would you do with it? What would you do to say thank you to all those people who have subscribed to you? Share this video to a friend so that you can inform them about the new scam routine. Don't forget to follow us on our social media, the links will be down below. And also, don't forget to like, subscribe, and gong that bell. Gong! Once again guys, my name is Nold, bringing you news from YouTube and Freedom. Always remember, Freedom News. I will see you on the next episode. Goodbye!